Welcome back, witches, wizards, and muggles, and today we are going to be reviewing The Mirror of Erised. Let's go see what type of secrets lie within. That's right, I said review The Mirror of Erised because I don't believe I ever unboxed this. I bought this the latter part of two years ago, and I was so excited to have it, I just hung it up. So, right here is a miniature version of the Mirror of Erised. One day I hope to actually have the full size Mirror of Erised to show you, but we take what we can get. So we've got the Harry Potter trademarks on the back, the Harry Potter logo, timestamp, everything right there. This is a 2018 version of this mirror. This is made of die cast zinc. Now, there are some sites that say that this is made of stone, which is completely false because this. This is not stone. It is heavy, though. It is a little bit over five pounds. But before we get into all this detail, let's go ahead and take a closer look. And here we have the Mirror of Erised with its secret spoken language right there at the top of the mirror. This thing is extremely detailed for a mirror, but it's not really... The details behind the mirror, its magical abilities, and the secrets that lay within the mirror. So with that closer look, you can see that this thing is extremely detailed. It looks old-fashioned, just like something you would see in Harry Potter. The back of it, though, is just black. But we do have detail all around the frame. And we even have little windows, I guess you can call it, right here. It's all one piece of glass shaped to this, I'm assuming. But just the design that we have over it makes it look like a couple different windows. And if you look closely, you'll see this message written in what seems to be a different language. But I'll give you a hint. It's actually written backwards. So if you take a look and actually try to read it along with me, it says... I show not your face, but your heart's desire. So the Mirror of Erised, if you didn't know, shows you your heart's deepest desire. Dumbledore actually said that the person that has everything they want in life would simply look at the mirror and see nothing but themselves in the mirror. But I guess for those that have an unfinished life, those that aren't happy, look in the mirror and see exactly what they want. Harry Potter looked in the mirror and seen his parents. He thought the mirror showed exactly what he wanted. But Dumbledore cleared that up. It's not what you want, it's what you desire. So Dumbledore looked in the mirror and said, I see myself holding a thick pair of woolen socks. You could never have too many socks. But there's a little bit of controversy over what he, he actually sees. It's rumored that Dumbledore, when he first looked into the mirror for the very first time in his life, he saw none other than Grindelwald. Grindelwald and Dumbledore were the best of friends. And maybe to Grindelwald's unknowing, Dumbledore loved Grindelwald. So he saw Grindelwald in the mirror, his old friend, his old lover. That's what Dumbledore desired. But it is rumored that when he looked in the mirror after Harry Potter, what he saw was his guilt about his sister, Ariana, being murdered. But it's unclear what he actually saw. He could have looked in the mirror that time and saw Grindelwald again. We don't know. But what I do know... As this mirror right there is really nice. And I got to tell you, this thing weighs about just shy of six pounds. Now, one of the things is you can just set it on the table like this. It's going to tilt back slightly, just like this, just like a picture frame would. Or you can hang it up on the wall. I actually prefer to hang it up. It's kind of a nice looking thing to hang up and it's actually a mirror. It's actually usable. You can actually use this. It's not just a prop. It is a prop replica, 
but it's something that you can actually use. So there we have the Mirror of Erised. I hope I did this justice in all the detail and all of the glory this thing holds. If you want a little bit more attention on the Mirror of Erised and less attention on the story behind it, let me know and I will make another video detailing the best I can about the Mirror of Erised, but I think this video did it justice.